Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have another After Dark Clean with me. You guys have been loving the After Dark Cleaning videos lately, so I figured I would go ahead and share another one with you guys. Plus, this is like my very favorite cleaning video to film for you guys because cleaning at night is just so relaxing and so therapeutic to me. So I just love it and waking up to a clean house is so relaxing. I feel like it always just gets me started off on the right foot the next day. So it's definitely something I do quite often. And my husband is actually getting the boys to bed right now and then he's heading downstairs to work on our unfinished basement. So I have a little bit of time. I'm just going to tackle this kitchen. If you follow me over on Instagram, you know that my mom and sister were here visiting us. They just left to go back home and so I really have kind of let go of the kitchen, especially during this time, just kind of trying to soak in that last little bit of time with them. So I really have a lot to get done in here. So I'm really just going to be focusing on the kitchen and the dining room for now. But before we get started, I will go ahead and show you what I am dealing with. So starting out in our dining room, as you can see, I need to just kind of surface clean everything and really seriously in the kitchen. I have a sink full of dishes. I have not touched dishes other than cleaning up the pots and pans that we cooked with a little bit today, but I really have so much to just clean up and tidy up in here. And then I also need to just do a little bit deeper of a clean in here as well, because as I said, I have not really focused on this so much while my family was here. Yesterday was supposed to be quiet Be into myself and sit in silence I also want to let you guys know that I have teamed up with Grove Collaborative on this video. I have a link down below that will give you all of these goodies for free and you can pick whatever fall scent you want. And if you are already a Grove Collaborative customer, go ahead and still click that link and you can get some free walnut scrubber sponges added to your order. Let me know in the comments if you guys have smelled the new scents and if you have, if you have a favorite, mine is definitely the apple cider. I have been able to try the pumpkin and I kind of liked it, but it might almost smell a little bit too sweet to be a cleaner, but my husband smelled it and he was obsessed with it. So I went ahead and got some and I'm just going to see how I like it if it kind of grows on me a little bit more. But right now I'm still just a little bit torn on it. Uh -oh. Whoa. So one thing that I do every single night is I will load up our dishwasher. Now this was kind of a different day because I did not get around to any dishes during the day. We just spent time with our family before they left. So usually our dishwasher is a little bit more full already before we start it. But today I just had to put the entire sink full of dishes in at night. And then in the morning when we wake up, the boys can go ahead and empty out the dishwasher and I can get it started for the next day. If you have a dishwasher, let me know in the comments if you prefer to use your dishwasher or if you like to hand wash things. My mom is so funny because she has a dishwasher at her house and we have a dishwasher at our house. I always just see her washing dishes by hand instead of just loading up the dishwasher for a few minutes but I think it's something that she just kind of enjoys and feels like it's easier to do that way. I will always wash a few things by hand like my pots and pans and my knives but everything else will go into the dishwasher and I love it that way. I feel like it just saves me so much time. So after washing my dishes, I wanted to go ahead and clean out my dish station, which has my bubble up dish brush and my dish soap and also my spray cleaner. Now that I got the new fall scents, I am going to go ahead and put these ones away for now and start using the fall scents because I have been waiting for these for quite a while. I am so super excited. So once all the dishes are nice and clean and my dish station is clean and drying, I am just going to start cleaning out my sink. And I am just using the Mrs. Meyer Surface Scrub. I believe this one also comes in a lavender, but I just have it in the scent Lemon Verbena because I feel like it smells so bright and fresh. I do this every night and anytime there is just dishes sitting in the sink, 
I will always just clean it because I feel like it just gets really gross and dirty, but I love how well it works and I always get questions on what I scrub my sink out with and I actually just use the Grove Collaborative Walnut Scrubbers, but I do cut them in half because I feel like they are a little bit easier to manage, plus it gives me double the use. Just living off the edge Only good times ahead So let me put a smile upon your face And then after my sink is all nice and clean, I am just putting back together my dish station. And I get so many questions about this all the time, but this tray is actually from Grove Collaborative. It is called the Stoneware Tray, and I love that I can still keep my products on my counter and it just looks so put together and organized. So it is definitely a kitchen favorite for me. So one thing that I do that is a little bit different than I've seen other people do is I actually hang my dish towel on my dishwasher and then I pull it up and actually use it as a drying cloth for all my dishes when I hand wash them and I love it because I don't have to have an actual drying cloth and I also feel like my dishcloth is finally useful because for the longest time when I used to just have my dishcloth on my oven, I felt like I never used it and it was really just decorative so I love things being able to be decorative and pretty but also be useful. So to wipe off my countertops today, I'm just using the Mrs. Meyers Multi-Surface Spray. Of course, this is in the apple cider scent. This one is my absolute favorite. And the cloth that I am using is also from Grove Collaborative. I've mentioned this in a few videos now, but I actually love the microfiber cloth from them. Most of the time, I am not big fans of the microfiber cloths because they kind of stick to my fingers and I just don't like the texture of it. But this one has not had that issue for me at all. And so I'm getting the benefit of having a microfiber cloth, which really kind of grabs all of the dirt and everything, but it doesn't bother my hands at all. So this is one of my new favorite cloths. The Supple Cider Spray has me so excited to decorate for fall this week. I love fall so much, so I usually start decorating the first week of September, but let me know in the comments when you start decorating. And just to let you know, I will be filming that, so I will have a fall clean and decorate with me up next week. So make sure that you are subscribed and the notification bell is on so that you won't miss that video because I have a lot of fun decor to share this year. He's not like you, don't want him to He's more like the river Growing stronger When we're alone, there's no you in the picture
You are stuck between the lines. Someone had told me that I will take off and find something greener, oh, greener than gold. If someone had told me that I will be strong, oh, I'm gonna rise, gonna rise and fly and leave the gold between. Still got your pearls hanging by my bedside. Still got your lips. Next, I just wanted to go ahead and wipe off my three tiered stand. I get questions about this all the time, and I actually got it about a year or year and a half ago from Costco. It was pretty inexpensive there because it was on sale, and I just saw about a month ago that it was on sale at Costco again. So definitely go check out your local Costco. It comes in so, so handy, especially if you are needing to save space. It is really nice. The next thing I wanted to do was give my stove a good clean. I do this about once a week and I am just using the Mrs. Meyers baking soda cream cleaner. This is one of my favorite cleaners. It is so easy to use and it works so perfectly, especially when you need a little bit more of an abrasive cleaner. So I feel like when you're cleaning your stove or anything like that, it is just the perfect cleaner to use. I will also use this on my sink sometimes, but definitely for my stove, this one is my go-to. So once I have the stove nice and scrubbed down, I am just taking the microfiber cloth and trying to remove as much of that product as I can, and then that way I can go over it in a minute with my e-cloths. So if you've watched my channel for a while, you know how much I love and rave about e-cloths all the time. They work so good, especially on your stainless steel. I have not found anything that cleans quite as well as them. And all they use to clean is just water. So I am taking the all-purpose e-cloth and just wiping down my stovetop. And then I'm going in right after with the e-cloth glass and polishing cloth. And this is the cloth that's really going to shine up your appliances and it will leave zero streaks. It is so incredible. Let me know if you guys have tried e-cloth before. I feel like they are a lot like the Norwex cloths, but they are also a lot cheaper. One day the magic stopped for us. Oh, Emily. thought breakups were pretty you told a lie i let you go started the words that i completed 
But that was then, so long ago I told you then, like I say now That we were golden Now you're not here, you brought us down I told you so Oh, how I wish I didn't care That we were okay That I could just erase, rewind, let it roll Meet me back here next year And I'll be fine by then We were on a high but now we're letting go And finding the way back is all I know All I know from now I'm thinking by myself, I'm minding just my own So when we meet again, I'm fine by then Fine by then, I'll be fine by then I go to bed to get up early I go to work and not much change I met a girl and she's quite funny But I'm not quite there, ready for love It's been alright without you Next I just needed to take out the trash This is something that my husband usually does But I wanted to go ahead and wipe it down So I just went ahead and changed it out myself I am so looking forward to the boys getting a little bit older Because then we can kind of pass this chore along to them Taking out the trash is such an easy thing But for some reason it is something that I really kind of dread doing So I will usually just have my husband take it out whenever it needs to be And now I'm fine by then we were on a high, but now we're letting go And finding the way back is all I know All I know from now I'm thinking about myself, I'm minding just my own So when we meet again, I'm fine by then Fine by then, I'll be fine by then We were on a high, but now we're letting go And finding the way back is all I know All I know from now so the last thing I needed to do was just the floors and normally because it is pretty late I would just be sweeping but as I said my husband was downstairs working on our basement and he actually had to disconnect the pipe for our central vacuum system and only because our boys are such good sleepers I decided to go ahead and vacuum tonight because our floors really needed it. And I always get questions on what kind of vacuum I have. This one is the Dyson VA Absolute. I really love this one because it has a little bit better battery life than the other ones. And it also comes with a ton of different attachments, which makes it really, really handy. Back at the spot where you first kissed me. I don't feel a thing, although I should. I learned my lesson last year. And now I'm fine again. I also get questions on where we got our rug from, what kind of flooring we have, and also what our wall color is. So I will leave all of that information down below for you guys so you guys can check that out if you are interested. By this time Kyle had come up from working downstairs, so I had him go ahead and help me move the rug. One thing I'm learning is rugs on hard floors really move around a lot, especially with little kids, so I feel like we have to do this every couple weeks or so. Please, please, please let me know if you have any advice to offer because this is so frustrating and annoying when we have to do this every few weeks, but it moves quite a bit, so it's something that definitely has to happen. If there is something that I could do to prevent this from happening, I would be so thankful. Can I see you again? Can I see you again sometime? If you be standing by your door, I'll pick you up at eight. I said, whoa, whoa. you wanna do it again? Do it again sometime?
If you've been following me for a while, you know that one of my least favorite chores is mopping and my husband really doesn't mind it. And just because he is so amazing, he actually offered to mop for me and I was definitely not going to turn that down. Can you tell me what you want to do? I'll do anything you ask me to. As long as I can spend the day with you, day with you. Lipstick, left a mark on my cheek, so I keep thinking of you. Whoa, you wanna do it again, you wanna do it again sometime. Whoa, can I see you again, can I see you again sometime? If you'll be standing by your door, I'll pick you up at eight, I said. So I hope you guys enjoyed this after dark cleaning video. I know I love cleaning at night. I feel like it is just so relaxing as I said before. Let me know in the comments below if you like to clean at night or in the daytime. I am definitely a night cleaner. I feel like especially being a mom and just not having to have the kids needing me every two minutes while I'm cleaning and also waking up to a clean house is just so perfect to me. So I actually really enjoy cleaning at night. I hope you guys enjoyed watching and I hope you got the cleaning motivation that you were needing today. Do not forget to subscribe down below if you are not already and also follow me over on Instagram and I will see you in my next one.